Smith's Detection has the most comprehensive range of detection technologies in the world today for use in areas including aviation security, ports and borders, facility security, military, life sciences, product inspection, or emergency response. Smith's Detection Scientific offers microanalysis and trace detection technologies for homeland security and industrial applications. Markets that we serve include mobile laboratories, forensics, public health, and the pharmaceutical and chemical industries. Applications include identification of unknown chemicals, drug discovery research, process optimization research, cleaning validation, polymorph screening, forensic analysis and material identification, quality control, and screening of microsamples such as chemical and biological WMDs. Smith's Detection presents the identifier. A major benefit of the identifier's small footprint and rugged construction is that it can be used in an organic chemistry lab where you would normally not place an IR spectrometer. It can be located next to the chemistry in the fume hood for instant chemical characterization. In the front of the unit is the DuraDisc sample interface. This is a diamond ATR integrated into the system. The diamond ATR sampling interfaces come in three versions. There is a one bounce, three bounce, and nine bounce DuraDisc available for the system. This item is the sample press. One is to press a solid sample tightly against the diamond interface so that we may get an appropriate IR signal from our sample. The second is that it provides bright field illumination for viewing samples that are placed over the diamond. The illumination is adjusted by turning the knob that is on the side of the system. The illumination is provided through the sample press tip shown here. At this point, we are ready to analyze a sample. We begin the analysis by clicking on the Acquire Sample button. And so we click on the Acquire Background button. The system will show us that it is performing scans of the background. And when it is completed, it will say Scan Complete. And we will see what we refer to as the 100% line, or a zero absorbance line, on the screen. At this point, we are ready to add a sample to the diamond. In this case, we're going to analyze a simple powder sample. And we only need a small amount of the sample to perform analysis. So we place a few grains of the powder, which we can see appearing on the monitor. We can adjust the camera illumination to either give us a dark field view in which this white powder shows up on a black or dark background, or we can use the bright field illumination in which the sample appears uh, as dark on a light background. Once we have determined that the sample is in place, we lower the sample press till the tip contacts the sample, and then we press down on the sample. What we will see in most cases is that the sample spreads out across the surface of the diamond, giving us better contact. And we will also see the spectrum for the material appearing in the data acquisition window on the computer. In this case, I am taking the sample pressure up to 79, which gives me a good, strong spectrum for this material. When you're satisfied that the sample spectrum looks appropriate, you click on Acquire Sample. The system will indicate that it is scanning. And you can see in real time the spectra that are collected. When it is finished, the window will say Scan Complete. If you're happy with the spectrum, you click on Accept Data. At this point, the spectrum will appear along with 
the best search result from our library. To prepare to run the next sample, you release the pressure on the sample press and again using a laboratory tissue saturated in solvent, clean off the diamond surface. If you're analyzing solids, you also need to remember to clean the underside of the press tip before analyzing your next sample. The simplest way to do this for most samples is to use a Pasteur pipette, put it into the sample, and allow capillary action to pull sample up into the pipette. To dispense the sample onto the diamond, sometimes all you need to do is to touch the tip of the pipette to the diamond. When the sample is in place and you see a spectrum on the display, you click Acquire Sample. The system will scan for the designated number of scans. When it is complete, click on Accept Data, and the software will perform a spectrum match looking for the best fit with your sample spectrum. If you would like more information or a personal demonstration of the identifier, please feel free to contact us toll-free at 888-444-4777, outside the U.S., 203-207-9700, or visit us on the World Wide Web at smithsdetection.com. Thank you.